So in this video, we have a force of 30 newtons is needed to slide a mass of 8 kilos along a rough horizontal surface at a constant velocity. What is the coefficient of friction between the mass and the surface? So let's draw a diagram. Here is my block, okay, or my mass, and it has a mass of 8 kilos, so it has a weight of 8g. It's in contact with the surface, so the normal reaction force is R. Um, now, a force of 30 newtons. So we've got 30 newtons acting to the right, so we'll have the frictional force working to the left. And it's going along at a constant velocity, which means that the acceleration is zero. Now, what is the coefficient of friction between the mass and the surface? Well, because it's moving, we know that the friction is going to be equal to mu times r. So if I resolve vertically, taking upwards as positive, we'll have r take away 8g is equal to 0. So r is 8g. And if I resolve horizontally, taking to the right as positive, we'll have 30 take away the friction is equal to 0 because uh, the acceleration is zero. So the friction is equal to 30. So we know then that 30 must be equal to mu times r. So mu must be 30 over 8g. Um, and so that will be 15 over 4g. OK. Now, we can put in g as 9.8. So 15 over 4 times 9.8, and that gets us 0 0.383 to three significant figures.